Hello Maxon here, welcome to the 11th video of my EU4 Sweden Let's Play. Uh, so in the last video, I basically made peace with the Teutonic Order and the Livonian Order. Uh, I took the final Livonian Order province and that basically ended the coalition uh, that was arrayed against me because they were the leaders. Uh, Pomerania made a separate peace with the Teutonic Order and took Danzig and uh, Warmia or Varmia. Uh, so they are getting very strong now actually. I think they have a tax base of 39. Uh, in 1.5 you can supposedly uh, dip or offer a vassalization to a nation that has less than 40 tax base or 40 tax base. So they're just within that range when I finally upgrade to the 1.5 patch. This is uh, 1.4. One still, which is the hot fix that came out. Uh, so apart from that, I'm planning a war against Denmark and their alliance, uh, which is going to be in about 76-ish. Uh, I forgot to turn off my army maintenance as well in the last video, uh, so I've been uh, wasting a bit of money since uh, the war against uh, the Teutonic Order ended. My war exhaustion's going down a bit. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get rid of it all by the time the war starts, sadly. Um, I should actually make claims against Denmark if I haven't already. I think I'd forgotten about that. Uh, Diplomat's back in a few days, so I'll do that then. Uh, so what claims can I make over here? I'll do uh, Nord Zealand first. I have uh, extra spy offence at the moment, so there's much less chance of me being caught. Uh, right, so pause. Wouldn't mind buying some cannons as well, but I'm not sure if I want to do that or um, save up money to buy armories and barracks I'm going to be, I want to get admin tech 7 so I can uh, get the, a uh, new idea which is going to be a military idea or I'm going to be wasting a ton of uh, military points if I can't do that quickly um, so war is going to start in July so I need to have my troops uh, positioned pretty well for then probably. Uh, so supply in the area uh, 30, 30 it's all pretty good in the, around here. Uh, Norwegian armies up there. I think I move to there. I might split some troops and stick it in Pomeranian territory as well. Uh, so I want to take Mecklenburg. Oh wow, so I was discovered. What was the risk then? I thought it was like 0.6% uh, or something. Um, army's reached for Heslin. Uh, diplomat comes back from uh, Denmark. I'm going to ask um, the Pomeranians for military access. Okay. Um, right. I've accepted. Claim fabricated in Norway. What's my advice? The situation is fine, I think. I'm actually making some money now. Uh, diplomat is back from Pomerania. Uh, where should I stick you to? I think I've done all the claims I can in Norway now. Uh, Norway is still in a personal union. Uh, under Norway, yeah, all the fabricates are done there. Can't fabricate on Teutonic Order, sadly. Um, I can, I think, make a claim on Scotland, so maybe I should do that. Aberdeen or the Highlands, I think I'll do whichever the lowest is, Highlands, in uh, terms of risk of discovery. Right, uh, pause again. Right, Diplomat is back from Norway. I think I'm gonna make a cannon or two um, over in Stockholm then. That's one, I need some more money. I might get rid of my mercenaries in a bit. Oh, I've still got a diplomat spear. I'll stick you uh, back in Muscovy for a bit. Relations there. It's finished already. Oops, diplomat's back. Let's make a cannon here. 
Uh, what's my relations like? Who hates me the most? Ottomans don't like me particularly now, but it's probably just the European ones I should uh, do first. There's a bit of aggressive expansion there, so I'll improve relations there. Stop them from joining the coalition potentially later. Um, okay. Earth Rampart was finished. Well, marriage again with uh, Pomerania. Um, it's coming to the point where I wouldn't mind a personal union potentially with them, maybe, or. Uh, but I think I'll decline for the moment. Okay. Have a bit more money. Should I make another cannon? I think I will. Uh, Disagreeing advisor. Who's five prestige are off with his head. Uh, I want the extra monarch points. And I can get prestige back in the war very quickly. Okay. Uh, I need to uh, start to figure out my troop placement actually. Um, so I'm going to... Probably should have been making cogs recently as well actually. Um... Going to make how many units do I want down? Basically, I want to bring some units down here so I can take Mecklenburg before Pomerania or any of my allies do. Uh, so, I want one, two, three, four. Have four cav and two cannons when I can get them down there. I've got a new leader recently, so we can go there. I uh, can go down to Kinge. Cup, bring a couple of cannons down there in a minute. Uh, okay. Put my maintenance on in a month or two. My war exhaustion is 1.46. I will start the war even though I've still got it, I think. Uh, right, so they've reached there. Kind of needs maintenance still. I'm going to split this in half and attach at this can with there. Transport can, place them over there. Right, England now controls the courier, which is really bad for me. That's been very helpful. Gonna lose a diplomat because of that and various other uh, things. Um, yeah, it's really nice the couriers. Uh, oh, so I've actually got some power there, so I might be able to get it back at some point. Okay. Attach there, those, those there. Let's uh, increase my army maintenance. Uh, Finnmark and Reykjavik haven't yet uh, cored, which isn't good if I'm going to start this war because it will stop them from coring. Uh, but I've got harsh treatment in both of those provinces, so they're not going to be a problem to me. I'll uh, finish calling them up after the war. And uh, whatever provinces I take are going to be low tax base, so I'm not going to go over my overextension limit, I believe. Uh, so we've reached, I've got my 8,000 odd troops there. The fleet can go back to there. I'm probably going to have to blockade the Orsund at the start of this war. Uh, I've got a cannon here. I'm actually bring that down there. But no, it's cross. Uh, okay. Right. Attach that here. Move to there. There, I should say. No, actually, it's full palm I want it to move. Two. Right, so uh, they can move to there. What day exactly now? 
Uh, I'm only down to two diplomats, sadly. Uh, so July 17th. Which for Pommern, we can go back to there. I think I'm going to move to Stockholm actually. Since a cannon is going to be built there. Okay. Alright, so cannon can attach there. I'll bring these down to the Southern Baltic. So just over a month and this war is going to start. Why would Finnmark finish 17th of July in a year actually? I thought that was this year for a second. Uh, right, so transport can move to can enter there. Claim has been fabricated in North Yilland, uh, which for Pommern. I think there's one more Danish province I can claim. I'll wait, I'll get this back actually. Okay, diplomats back. Let's make a, another claim then on Bornholm. Uh, how long does this last for? Um, oh, that's about to uh, go actually. Um, arguably, I should uh, do that claim as well before I start this war, but I think I won't. Um, Alright. Uh, I've got enough for. No, I haven't actually got enough for another cannon. So, truce is 17th. Just then. I uh, should have moved my fleet a bit actually. Um, so, they haven't got anyone else in the alliance. My morale is maxed out. Uh, decisions. Reclaim Halland. What's that? Ten prestige. You probably won't, probably won't need that really by the end of the war. I should have a hundred anyway. But I'll bring my trade fleet over to here. Uh, diplomats back in a day. Um, I think I'm ready to declare war. I'm quite a bit over my force limits probably now. Only six actually. I right, blockade the Osund and then declare war. I'll move my ships to the Orsund and then the Clibble. Uh, so they can group up. Move there. Right, Scotland on the alliance with France. So England and France and Scotland are all at war. Could be interesting. Danish uh, fleets up here. Uh, I need to keep them there to stop them from moving troops over. Right, so we're in a position to declare war. War exhaustion is still a bit iffy, but what's that going to do? Next to nothing, really. It's not too bad. Um, so, yeah, declare war. I Oh, I've sent a diplomat, so 9th of August, I have to wait to. Lost the claim on Mitt Yellens. Once it's actually finished, it's only just started. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm not, I don't want to delay war any longer. So, uh, don't have enough for cannon. I said declare war. I'm not going to call in all of my allies. I'm going to do them separately. I think. Um, hopefully, they've got enough time for them to get back. Uh, Guess we'll find out in a minute. So, uh, declare war. I shall take Halland. That's my war aim. Declare war. Right. So let's. Um, they stop coring up, which I knew was going to happen. Uh, Pomerania. Oh, I don't actually need a diplomat to uh, call to arms. So I'll call Pomerania in. And I'll call Poland in. I don't think I want Muscovy in a war. 
Although, arguably, it wouldn't be such a bad idea. They probably wouldn't take any territory over here. Maybe. But I don't think I'd call them in. I probably don't want to take get the hands in because they might take uh, territory here. And it would be hard to get hard to get uh, those territories off them uh, than it would be for me to take off Denmark because they're a HRE nation. Uh, okay, so... Right, uh, right, so various people have joined in. Uh, they have next to nothing compared to us. I'll move my units onto Mecklenburg. Should be still... Right, take the water to the seven shore. Control Mitt Yellens. I definitely want to do this, so I'll try not to... Well, I'll take it now to make sure I can do this a bit later. Ten army tradition would be very nice. Uh, papal influence. I'm still in the lead there. Austria started to invest. They're all... There's only one in the 40s there. I'll move my army to take on the Norwegian troops there. Um, okay. Navy centre attack in the Osund. I should have more than enough here. I've actually forgot to put my Admiral on here, which I hadn't realised. That's not good. Uh, so, how, when? When? He probably hasn't been on there for a very long time, actually, so that's really bad. Engaged uh, Mecklenburg, destroyed the thousand troops. And Fortress is under siege. Uh, there's Danish forces there. Wow. Uh, Lithuania has a ton of troops up here still, somehow. Um, still in exile. I guess the uh, exile bug hasn't been completely fixed in uh, this patch. It is in the beta patches, I think. Uh, so Battle of uh, Osund has been won. Didn't destroy them, though, really. Um, I think I will move out a small amount of galleys and then put my hero or leader on there. My fleet's been damaged a bit and the Danish are going to be able to repair and I'm not really uh, if I'm going to keep this uh, blockade up. Uh, so Diplomat is back from Denmark, I'll stick him in uh, Muscovy. Why aren't they doing that now? Distant war. Okay. Revelations. Um, right. Engage the enemy. Uh, Norway has... Oh, that reminds me. I should probably uh, make a couple of uh, mercs here. Right, I need a bit more money. I've also forgotten to stick war tax on, which I'm definitely going to need. Okay, so I'll make another mercenary over here to take that in a minute. Um, okay. Battle of... Right, Norwegian force has been wiped out. Uh, there's army up there. Right, how many provinces do they have? They have one, two, three, four, five. So I'll probably just split my army up quite a bit here. That. Put the leader there, move them back to your Sund. Uh, so, what was it? One, two, three, four, five. So, one, two, three, four. I shall uh, close there. Close there. Close there. Move my. Um, I'll keep my leader here actually. 2000 should be enough to take there. It's probably too much attrition on. I'll supply limit 8. Uh, but winter could kick in. Uh, yeah, I'll move this up there. Maybe I shouldn't though. Actually, it's mainly mercenaries, so that's okay. Um, Alright. Uh, back to your Sund. Uh, looks 
I'm not sure if these Lithuanian, hopefully they're moving back. Uh, where's Pomerania to? They're still over there. Yeah, Danish forces aren't moving down to Mecklenburg, which is maybe good for me actually. There's a couple of Danish units there which I need to go and kill when I can. Um, right. They're not. I need 10 more men before that starts to siege up. Should uh, happen quickly though. Uh, I think. Pom Pomerania are allied to Muscovy, which I'm not sure is good really. I might want to declare war on them eventually. Make another mercenary over here. Into there. Okay. There's pirates up there which I've forgotten about, which I'll have to uh, kill at some point. Okay, diplomat is back from Muscovy. Uh, what are my relations like? I think I might prove. Oh, Pomerania is maxed out. What about Poland? I probably haven't done them for a while. Yeah, I'll improve a bit here. Oops. Trondlag and Jamplund. Uh, I've got a new cannon by right here. Folks over there. What's my force limit like? Nine over, I believe. Uh, right. Danish is still there. I have one jam at Jampland. I'll uh, siege up and detach. Is that enough to siege it? Yeah. Okay, it's only level one four. I'll right, bring these uh, troops that back down to Harland. Right. Uh, Battle of Trondlag is won. Uh, so this is all going like clockwork so far. Uh, fortress under siege. Still no sight. Right, Lithuanian troops are moving in. I need to siege up that province if I'm going to complete my mission, but uh, siege up Mecklenburg and Saxe-Lauburg is more important to me. You know what I think. Saxe is going to win there. Okay. Agent was discovered. Right, this uh, over there. I'm actually losing money. I could get rid of some mercs. Could lower my maintenance for a bit. Or I could just take a loan. I think I'd take a loan actually. Right. Right. Just there. Danish uh, managing to get troops over here. Not really sure how. They must be doing it via ship. I don't see how they get through the Orsund otherwise. Right, so we gauge them at Halland anyway. And wipe them out for next to no losses. I'll gauge them at Skane. I need to get up to Gotland in a bit as well. Okay. One there. I think I think I might actually attach a couple of units to the siege up there. Uh, one of these should get done relatively soon and then I'll chase that unit down. Danish still aren't moving for some reason. Okay. Has Pomerania moved yet? Don't know. Can't see them. Uh, right, let's see jump there. Good luck to you. Gonna kill them in a bit. Okay, cast this belly, trade and bag with by Lithuania as usual. Right, 
right, so um, I can even put the time out for a bit. Nothing much happening. Danish aren't moving, so uh, Siege of Jampland has been won. Uh, so I'll um, I've actually got 2,000 forces here. What's the next siege going to be done to? I think I'll uh, move those over to Trondlag. I need to get some cogs. Actually, I'll uh, yeah, I'll take some units out of here. I'll take my. I've got five cogs now. I must have captured a couple, maybe. I'll take a couple of galleys. And I'm gonna move those over here. I'll probably get the Jamplin troops and then bring them over to uh, the Faroe Islands. Uh, this siege up. Looks like England are winning that war, which is not surprising really. Get Scotland. Uh, so Burgundy Annex Cleaves. One leg. Good up. Okay, so Denmark now has a new kin, and that means that Norway have more than likely uh, become an independent nation because Denmark's prestige was so bad they've uh, dropped out of their union. So I'm hoping that Norway doesn't. Uh, ally anyone who I well if they allied to England basically that would cause me problems I wouldn't be able to uh, declare war on them so easily next time but in, it could be a good thing uh, if I can do separate wars against them uh, in future will be a good thing uh, as long as they don't ally to anyone horrible uh, so my fleet is up here now I'm going to how many troops do I have here I have five. I'm going to take a couple of the mercs out and move them over. Spread of Discoveries, the Azores. Uh, Bergen Schuss is done. I shall. There's a little fleet there. Uh, probably should try and kill those. I'll move. Um, Actually, I'm in danger of losing that province, so I'm not sure where my leaders are. One is down here and one is down there, I think. Right, I'll, um... Hands are at war. Yeah, they're at war with Saxe-Lauburg. That's not good for me, actually. Um... I think I might... Not sure if I can take over the siege or not here, but I may be able to because they're not currently sieging it up properly, but I'm going to try. Um, so this army, yeah, I need to kill those. Let's try it. Um, yeah, okay. Okay, Agatha's done. There, so it looks like the hands are, are still in charge actually. There was just a pain, big pain actually. I wouldn't mind taking that province in this war. Um, so, get those troops, move those there, but just move them straight there. So, not percent. Uh, Western Norwegian Sea. Bring my mercs up to Faroe Islands. Okay, gonna have to destroy that Danish army at some point. It doesn't look like the Pomeranians or the Lithuanians or the Polish are helping me out. Uh, so Siege of Trondlag is done. I'll bring those down to there as well. I don't think I had to take a loan either, which is good. Oh, uh, they have troops here. Um, 
probably have enough to kill them. Even with a uh, landing penalty, but might have to get some reinforcements, I think. Okay, so if one there and wipe them out, uh, they can group up. Actually, put those to there. Go there. Right. Gauge the Pharaoh Islands. Even if I win, I'm not going to be able to have enough to siege up because uh, i lost troops there, which is a pain. Alright, so uh, I can shoot has been done. I'll bring this fleet to uh, bring some more troops in a bit in a second. Um, Probably a lot down here actually. Okay, so uh, we've run in Faroe Islands, they've been wiped out because they didn't have anywhere to go to. So, how many troops? I need about another thousand nearly. Uh, so, bring Cogs back here. Uh, Mecklenburg Siege is one. Uh, this is still a Hansa Siege, sadly. Um, how many troops are there? Don't know. I uh, wouldn't mind. Could get a diplomat back to annex the Mecklenburg now. I think I'll actually wait. Uh, I may take it as part of the deal with Denmark, or I may do it separately, I'm not sure. Uh, okay, Siege of Akka. I think I will get a diplomat back though, I'll have a look. Uh, so, I've reached Halland, they can all group up. Uh, I think I'll actually call that an end of the video. Uh, so, in the next video, I'll be ferrying troops to the various... Uh, islands that the Alliance has left and taking on this uh, army here and maybe even making peace and taking a load of territory. Okay, uh, so thank you for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you next time.